Hey, what's up, guys? Scumfaith here, and welcome to this week's Team of the Week predictions. A very, very good looking Team of the Week once more. Looking forward to picking up some of these informs if they do indeed get selected for this week's Team of the Week. So, guys, in the comments below, let me know who do you think will get an inform this week. Also, if you could leave a like on this video, that would be awesome. Let's get into the potential informs. So, let's head into my potential informs. These are the players who I think could get an inform but haven't quite made it into my team to eat predictions. We start off with Ericsson, who scored twice, bringing Tottenham back into the game against Swansea. Two very nice free kicks. Kadira got a goal and an assist in a 3 1 win for Juve. Laporte got a goal in a 3 1 win for his side, Bill Bow. Cadona, now this card I hope happens. I loved his card last year and his team season was incredible. So, fingers crossed, Cadona gets the inform. Two goals and an assist for him in a 4 0 win. Normally, that probably would get into my predictions, but I just couldn't make room in the midfield for him. Lucas Prater, goal, two assists in a 3-0 win. Could see him getting the inform, we'll have to see. Pelé got a goal and two assists in a 3-1 win for Southampton over Chelsea. However, I already have a Southampton player in my prediction, so I had to leave Pelé out. And then on the end, we have Javinho at striker, who scored twice in a 4-2 win for Roma. On the second page, we start off with Pereira, who got two goals for PSV as they beat Ajax. Now, this is an inform that I could see happening. However, once again, just could not find room in my predictions to take someone out to put this guy in. But I definitely could see this one happening with it being quite a big game. Starko got a goal and two assists in a 4-0 win for his side. Maric there kept clean sheet in net and saved a penalty. Terezino, now this guy, another one. I really wanted to put him in, but once again, just could not find the room. Goal and two assists in a 5-0 win for his team. Glenn Johnson got an assist in a 1-0 win for Stoke. And Roberto Torres got a hat-trick. However, with two of them being penalties, that is why I left him out. So, on to my predictions. And we start off with PSG's Kevin Trapp. This guy made multiple saves in a 2-1 win for PSG. And although he did concede, he made seven saves and got a high match rating. So, that is why I've gone for him. Decent looking card, if you ask me. Dribio Sidiba, I think that's how you pronounce it. This guy got a goal and kept clean sheet in a 2-0 win for Lille. Jerome Boateng got two assists in a 5-1 win for Bayern Munich and Munich right now are just on fire. Ridiculous scoreline once again and uh, Boateng the centre-back getting two assists should be enough to see him get the inform if you ask me. Heiko Westermann, another German in my predictions got himself a goal and kept clean sheet in a 2-0 win for Real Betis. Hulk is next, three assists in a 3-0 win for Zenit. Very Good looking card and obviously Hulk contributing to every goal in that game should see him get the inform in my opinion. Sven comes. this guy got a hat-trick in a 4-1 win for his team. One of them was a penalty but a hat-trick is a hat-trick nevertheless and he should get the inform if you ask me. And his card, I know it's not the best looking stats wise but um, fairly well rounded for low rated goals. So yeah, could be a nice cheap inform. Mesut Ozil got a goal and an assist in a 3-0 win for Arsenal over Manchester United. Now, some people might be thinking Alexis Sanchez could get an inform this week. I don't believe he have ever given inform after inform two weeks in a row. So, um, yeah, I don't see Sanchez getting a second inform. But um, also, I can see him getting inform. He was awesome in that game. And, um, yeah, wouldn't be too bad at all. Next up is Lorenzo Insigne. Two goals and an assist in a 4-0 win for Napoli over Milan. Very, very impressive performance. And he should be getting the inform if you ask me. Sadio Mane, one goal and an assist in a 3-1 win for Southampton. Obviously, this inform could go to Graziano Pelle, but I've gone for Mane instead. And, um, yeah, looks pretty nice. Islam Slamani, I think that's how you pronounce it, got himself a hat-trick for Sporting. Not a bad inform, good physical attributes on him. And then, final player in the starting eleven is a guy called Sergio Aguero, who you may have heard scored a mere five goals this weekend against Newcastle, which is uh, pretty crazy. He actually got subbed off as well, so who knows? He could have got a bunch more. But um, nevertheless, awesome looking card. It's the star of the team of the week, and uh, probably going to be very, very expensive. So guys, that is my starting 11 predictions. Onto the bench we go, and we start with Gilly. Now this guy, he saved three penalties in one game, which is just incredible. The game did end as a 1-1 draw, so he did concede. However, saving three penalties in one game, in my opinion, Definitely deserves an inform. Moving on, Tom Miller. This guy got a goal and kept clean sheet in a 1 0 win for Carlisle. I needed a bronze player, so um, yeah, I threw in Tom Miller. However, I'm a bit unsure if he will get the inform or not, but um, to be fair, a defender getting a match winning goal and keeping clean sheet, he probably does deserve it, to be honest. Moving on, we've got Gustav Wickheim. I think that's how he, it's going to go. Two goals and two assists in a 6 1 win for him. Very impressive performance, looking like a very quick silver. Santos, once again, a nice looking silver card. Hat-trick for him in a 4-2 win. 
Vesterson got a hat trick in a 5 1 win, um, Thomas Nessed got a hat trick in a 3 2 win, and finally Charles on the end here for Malaga got a hat trick in a 3 1 win for Malaga. Yeah. Pretty much that. Anyway, guys, that is my team of the week prediction for this week. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. If you could leave a like this video, that'd be awesome. Have a good day. Adios.